Thank you for putting on a food drive for the Marysville Community Food Bank. In this video, you'll learn how to manage with banana boxes. When you receive boxes from the food bank, they're banana boxes, and they'll come like this in sets of three. What you need to do is separate these guys, pull one aside, and separate it one more time. That's actually the bottom of the box coming out of here. Now you see there's a big hole. You put something in there, it's going to go right through. So take this piece of paper and put it in the bottom. Now start loading her up. You want to put light and heavy things in the box, generally, if you can, to keep the box from getting too heavy. If it gets too heavy, it becomes a problem here at the food bank for folks to unload it and move it around. So we're going to load it up. It turns out if you have only cans, then you don't fill it all the way up to the top because that will end up being too heavy to lift. But let's just say you have a good mix of light and heavy stuff. Put them both in the box. And be gentle with the food because you want the folks that come to the food bank to get food, to enjoy undamaged food just like you do when you go to the grocery store. When you come across a jar, keep it separated from other glass items to reduce breakage. If you get a perishable item like spuds, Set those aside, you'll put that in another box, and when the food bank picks it up, make sure they see that separate so that it gets hauled away from, from these boxes, kept away, because when these boxes come to the food bank, it could be weeks before we get in there and, and unload the food, and, and that Hummer might get smelling worse than your gym socks. All right, so and we're gonna put the light stuff on top because we don't wanna smash it. And we don't want to go beyond the top of the box either, because now we're going to put the lid on. Dang. So now it's nice and stackable. Thank you for putting on a food drive for the Marysville Community Food Bank. Through your efforts, over 6,000 people in the town of Marysville will get something to eat this year as a result of you. Thanks again.